Hi Facebook, my name is Dr. Kimberly Elevens and I'm a board certified OBGYN doctor. I have been practicing gynecology for more than 15 years. Um, I completely love what I do and uh, because I've been doing this for a long time, I wanted to make a video. Uh, this is something to my ladies only. This is for people above the age of 21. Um, this is for all the women that are really working hard, doing what you need to do for your families, uh, for your honeys, uh, everything like that. This is in unscripted, so um, I'm not going to do you know, like a slideshow presentation or anything like that. But um, through the years, I've talked to a lot of my patients, and one of the things that I think is not um, discussed as much is things about their sexuality so if you are a guy uh, turn it off turn this off this is not for you if uh, you are someone who feels very uncomfortable with your sexuality or just may not want to hear about this this is not for you either so again this is for the women that really are looking for something a little bit more than what's out there this is about uh, feminine rejuvenation, which is basically something that's sweeping, that a lot of women have questions on, that inquire about. Um, I actually uh, have people with their own gynecologist who come and talk to me about this. And this is something that's for you. If you had questions about what's going on with all this stuff, then again, this is for you. So again, I'm a board certified OBGYN doctor. Um, I think what makes that special is that with all ladies, when it comes down to our sexuality, there's a lot of things that can get in the way. There's things that we can control, uh, and then there's a lot of things that we can't control. So sometimes we will have problems with our, um, with our uterus, such as fibroids, polyps, irregular bleeding. We can have problems with uh, menopause. We can have problems with our actual partner. Um, believe it or not, I've met women from all over the country, and that's one of the benefits about being out here in Sugarland, Texas, and near Houston, is that I have the pleasure of meeting people from all over. And it's amazing that when I talk to these ladies, even though culturally we are different, we actually share some of the same fear, some of the same desire, some of the same wants. Um, it's it's really amazing. So. With that in mind, um, it's also amazing that we women, we don't talk about our sexuality like we should. Um, this is something that was considered taboo back in the day, something we didn't used to talk about, something where we would be looked down upon or frowned upon if we did talk about our sexuality. But when the conversation is opened, it's like a waterfall, <laughs> you know? Um, women will divulge things to me, you know, that are secret and that are private uh, and that are personal. And I need them to let, to let them know by making this video that, hey, you're not alone and it's okay to talk about this because you will enrich your life. Um, to me, there's nothing more passionate and special than, you know, a person who is in love with who she is, who feels very comfortable with her femininity femininity, I'm sorry, um, or who feels very close to her partner um, because she's so much in love and she loves what she does. But unfortunately, there's a lot of things, again, like I said, that can get in the way. So um, it's important that when you talk about this, that you do have your gynecologist, because again, if you have those issues, such as fibroids or polyps or things like that, that has to be taken care of first. You know, you have to make sure that you're up to date with your pap smears and there's no um, underlying problems that are going on. So for example, if you have pelvic pain, that's not normal. That needs to be taken care of. Um, very heavy bleeding, if you're like overly fatigued, there's probably something medical that's going on. But at the end of the day, when all that stuff is taken care of, you know, you're still a human being that has wants and desires and needs, just like all the other women. So again, this video is for you. So. Um, Moving on, when we talk about um, rejuvenation, um, 
again, from having this conversation, a lot of women online, uh, they may be seeing other doctors who, um, who may talk to them about, uh, you know, cutting or doing surgery on uh, their female organs. And um, there's nothing wrong with that if that's what you need. So there are some women with prolapse, which is a medical condition where, you know, things need to be basically put back into place. Or uh, certainly um, if you have a, you know, extremely large labia or there's, there's just something else that's wrong. Yeah, you may be surgical candidates for that, but for the other ladies who simply want a little bit more special intimacy or uh, better orgasms or to feel their partner more, then these are some things that you can do that's out there that really has been proven to help you. So um, when I was growing up, there was uh, Dr. Ruth, um, which was the big one. And if you're old enough to know who Dr. Ruth is, uh, then um, then you kind of know where I'm going with this. So um, the importance of, uh, of being a lady and of, um, of having things to address your sexuality is because we are very complex. Um, again, uh, you know, not only the medical things can get in the way, but, um, you know, our kids could get in the way. Um, throughout time from having babies, you know, it could actually change the way we look and the way that we feel down there. And again, there are certain things that you can do to correct this problem, um, surgical corrections that you can make, but in terms of function, that may not be uh, for you. So, um, I'll give you an example. There's a lot of ladies who will have problems with having orgasms for different reasons. It could be something that's hormonal where maybe your hormones need to be balanced. Or it could be something that, um, you know, where anatomically we may feel more loose. Uh, we may not have the lubrication that's down there anymore. Um, as we all age, we all lose collagen every single day. Things will change. So by being able to rejuvenate that area, being able to give you back what you need, that is what feminine rejuvenation is. Um, I have uh, been to a few conferences. I talked to many different doctors about uh, different issues, uh, how they address different issues. And um, a lot of uh, the plastic surgeons, again, they wanna cut things. And you know, certainly uh, if you need a labial trim or want to do a labioplasty um, that's that's fine you know but in terms of will it make you happier will it make you have better orgasms that's not what that function is for so um, if you are interested in feminine rejuvenation um, here's some things that are out there uh, for you um, one of the things that we offer is called the O shot um, this is something from a brilliant gynecologist um, known as Charles Runnels, uh, who created this. Um, I'll show you a little model that I have here that I show to my patients all the time. If you look at this, this is basically um, female anatomy here. Uh, this may not, of course, represent you, but this is just an example of uh, female anatomy. This is uterus. This is basically where we have babies. This is cervix, this is rectum, this is bladder, um, this is vagina again. So as we age, these areas change and they can shift. You can develop scar tissue, different things that causes pain. But in terms of developing something that will help you out with having better orgasms, the O-Shot is definitely one of them. That's something where um, this represents where the clitoris is, where your blood is drawn and that goodness that comes from the blood is called platelet-rich plasma and it's actually placed in the clitoral region and the g-spot so if you're someone who has wonderful orgasms uh, be it clitoral stimulation or vaginal stimulation that's something that can definitely help you it also helps with um, urinary incontinence so um, that's something that's out there that I think is pretty well, awesome and wonderful. But even more exciting is something called the BTL Ultrafilm. This is something that just came out this year and 
I'm just so excited about it. I'm so excited for my patients. I did a study where I tested uh, 51 women and I looked at what happens to them, um, what happens with their sexuality when they get this special process done. So the BTL Ultrafem 360 is something that is uh, made from um, the BTL Ultra. Um, again, looking at our model here, it is a special device that when placed into the vagina, it gently uses radio frequency to help rejuvenate this tissue. It helps collagen grow. It leads to a tighter vagina. What's awesome about this is that it has uniform heating and it heats up from the back of the vagina to the outside. And then in addition, after the outside is tightened, you can actually treat the outside where the labia is. So you end up with definitely a more youthful appearance. You end up with smoother labia. You end up with a, a tighter vagina. You end up with a um, with uh, help in terms of urinary incontinence. But the most important thing that I found from my study is that women report orgasms that are more intense, that are um, more frequent, and that's something that I think is really awesome. So. If you are someone that have had kids or certainly you know as we get older and the tissue changes these are two things that are out there that really helps you that I think is really fantastic um, other things that are out there to help you because again we are complex being beings per se um, is uh, hormonal balancing uh, this is something that I would recommend to women who have problems with uh, libido. So there's something that we offer that's called BioT, um, hormone balancing, and that's basically where we check to see what your hormones are. We see where you need to be at to make them optimal, and we're able to make up that difference. And that's something that is very customized. Because it's bioidentical, it's as closest to your body as anything could be. It is, uh, in some studies, considered safer than uh, something that's uh, a natural. And um, by being able to combine these modalities, we're able to help women like a tremendous amount. So, I again, I meet people with problems with laxity. You know, we have something to help you know, them feel their partners more. We have women with problems with um, desire, which is low libido. We have the hormone balancing to help them with that. We have people with problems having orgasm and we have the O-shot to help them with that. So depending on what you need and um, where your most desires are, this is something that I would encourage you to talk to your gynecologist about. You know, make sure that you're up to date with your well woman exams, your, your mammograms, make sure you have someone that listens to you. And then these are things that are out there to help you. And that's, in my opinion, what true vaginal rejuvenation is. So if you have any questions, um, our website is sugarlandmedspa.co. Um, and we're here for you. Again, my name is Dr. Kimberly Levins, and thanks so much for listening, and I hope you have a wonderful and blessed day. Good luck to you all, okay? Thanks.